All right, Shalom. Let me start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem Yahushai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and bishops and elders of Great Millstone who teach and rule well, and salutations to the Akim out there laboring of the hopeful elect that's doing this work in truth and sincerity. And, uh, you know, as we are uh, entering, you know, the prophecies being fulfilled, you know, um, and another one that we see now that's uh, pretty much we see the framework of it, you know, about to come to pass is where, you know, uh, you know, the beast shall shall hate the whore, you know, and now um, we see, you know, through prophecy and, you know, the things that are going on in the earth, you know, we can understand, um, you know, pretty much how the scenario would go down or, or how the narrative will be painted to where, you know, uh, you know, America's allies would turn on them, you know, and um, um, this is from uh, Zero Hedge, you know, and, um, you know, with the ongoing war, you know, and really it, it's really NATO against Russia right now, you know, but pretty much, you know, they're still in, on the guise of, uh, of it being pretty much like a like a proxy war. And, you know, they're using uh, Ukraine, you know, as the proxy pretty much. But, um, you know, at the end of the day, it's really NATO against uh, uh, Russia. You know, um, and then, you know, you got the nations that are basically posturing, you know, pretty much with uh, Russia and, and, and they align themselves with, with China and uh, Turkey, you know, and Iran, you know, pretty much. And, uh, you know, and they're, they're joining forces uh, economically and militarily, you know, and um, as we see, you know, the, the further collapse that's going to, you know, happen pretty, pretty much soon, you know. And um, this article right here <clears throat> is uh, more of, you know, basically uh, uh, sanctioned wars that are going on, you know, and this is pretty much, uh, you know, uh, an economic blow. All right. As uh, Russia emits weaponization of gas, they halt NS1 shipments, you know, that stands for uh, 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 Nord Stream uh, uh, 1 shipments until sanctions lifted as EU prepares response to energy crisis you know and, and pretty much it's going to be a cold winter man for for uh the people uh in uh europe man in the european union you know because you know they rely a lot on russian um uh energy you know as far as with uh with their with their gas you know pretty much they use that to uh heat heat their homes heat the businesses you know and uh pretty much you know now that the war has has uh, uh you know gone down in Ukraine, there has been sanctions on, on Russia. But this whole, you know, scenario of, of trying to cripple Russia has backfired. You know, Russia now has a, 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 a pretty much a $20, $20 trillion uh, surplus, you know, because this, is ha this has basically uh, uh, empowered them, man, because now they're moving away from the U.S. dollar and moving towards uh, the rubles. Okay, so now when they're uh, selling their goods, you know, they're not no more using the, uh, the petrodollar, they're using the ruble. So everybody would, that deals with Russia would have to deal uh, uh, in rubles, you know, and, uh, you know, they're making uh, pretty much making good deals with, uh, with China and, and Iran. And, you know, and these, these, these nations are, are pretty much powerhouse nations, man. And everybody really uh, uh, is, is, is warming up to uh, the way how Russia is pretty much doing business now, you know. And along with, you know, China being a, being an uh, economic powerhouse in the earth, you know, and people are ba pretty much moving away from the U.S. dollar. And these sanctions, you know, that uh, the European Union has on Russia is pretty much backfiring on, on their end as well to where, you know, it, it, hardship and energy prices are rising, you know, and people are not going to be able to, you know, uh, uh, afford, you know, um, you know, the energy. You know, the, as far as uh, being able to heat their homes, and this is going to have a, a big impact, pretty much, on the world. You know, because as they have an economic downturn, which they which they are predicting, you know, uh, are pretty much in the upcoming weeks, man, they're just starting to say, you know, hey, you know, uh, pretty much things are going to pretty much change. You know, and we're going to see the, the effects of of economic downturn. We're going to first see it over, um, you know, across the pond, pretty much. You know, we get a pretty much a, a, a scenario of how things will, will be going down. And, you know, as us being watchmen, you know, we, we're measuring the time diligently in itself, 
you know, and we can get a nice little uh, snapshot of what, what's to come. But, you know, how about Shemar Bashar saves the best for last, uh, which is this great horror for Babylon the Great. You know, and the, the fall is going to be great for this place, man. You know, because the same hardships that are coming uh, in Europe, uh, they're going to reach over here as well, man. Because this whole, uh, you know, uh, scenario of, of, of e the EU becoming crippled, you know, over this energy crisis, man, is going to be a ripple effect on the whole, whole um, financial market, man. You know, which will lead into a full, full, you know, a full wedge uh, uh, war, you know. And, and it's, it's going to get ugly, man, you know. But, uh, hey, this is all the will of Yahweh Bashim Abishai, man. You know, but let's we'll read a little bit of this article. And it says, um, two days after Russia uh, indefinitely halted natural gas supplies via Nord Stream 1 pipeline for amusing reason, for amusing reason that there was an oil leak. You know, so that was the excuse that Russia had used at first, that there was an oil leak. So they shut down the pipeline, um, you know, saying that they needed to repair it. But now it's coming out that that they're using it as a weapon, man. You know, OK. And it says on Monday, Russia finally admitted that everyone has known since February, namely that it has weaponized commodities in response to the West's weaponization of currencies, you know. And it says, when the Kremlin said that Russia's gas gas supplies in Europe via Nord Stream 1 pipeline will not resume in full until the collective West lifts sanctions against Moscow over its invasion of Ukraine. So now you're seeing now the, 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 the economic uh, 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 war, okay, that's going on. You know, you know, it's physical, but it's also economic, you know, and uh, pretty much. They're fighting fire with fire as far as with the sanctions are concerned, you know, and uh, nobody is, is, is nobody in the European Union is to deal with Russia in any kind of way. You see, because, you know, the whole, uh, you know, the whole guise of how the sanctioning works is that if anybody would break that sanction, you know, and deal with them, that that country itself would be sanctioned. You see, you know, so pretty much, you know, uh, you know, it's a. Uh, uh, Goods and services are, are being disrupted, man. You know, and it's really uh, taking a toll on on Europe. So it says, um, uh, Putin's um, spokesman Dmitry Peskov blamed EU, UK, and Canadian sanctions for Russia's failure to deliver gas through the key pipeline, which delivers gas to Germany from Saint Petersburg via Baltic Sea. OK, and then Germany relies heavily on that, that Nord Stream uh, um, pipeline, you know, and uh, Germany is pretty much one of the one of the, uh, the strong, you know, uh, you know, the, one of the strong pillars uh, within the European Union. You see, you know, uh, pretty much uh, uh, financially and, in, in, you know, on a, or for the most part, you know, but it says problems pumping gas came about because of sanctions Western countries introduced against our country. And several companies, Peskov said, according to the Interfax news agency, there is no other reasons that could have caused this pump pumping problem. OK, but it says Peskov's comments were the most stark demand yet by the Kremlin that the EU that the EU role is back backs its sanctions in exchange for Russia uh, resuming gas deliveries to its continent. It also confirms that Russia no longer needs to pretend it, it needs to export commodities to Europe. After all, it has more than enough demand from China and India. And you got to remember something now, man. China and India, man, they make up a large population of the world's, um, they make up the large um, portion of the world's population, man. You know, China has over a billion people and uh, so does uh, uh, India. Okay. And that is uh, two huge markets now that, that, Russia is dealing with now to be able to sell their supplies, man. Their gas, their 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 uh, uh resource, man. You see, so it doesn't need uh, um uh, Europe now. So now it can play hardball, and 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 really, you know, and whether or not they get their way, it, it, it's it's a lose lose for for the European Union. You see, all right. So it says um that um that it has more than enough demand from China and in, in, in India. And is willing to give Europe just enough to to rope to, to rope to. Well, you know the rest. You know, basically, 
you know, they don't have to really give them anything, man. But they're going to try to use it as, as leverage, man. You know, and, and really, it's just going to get the war to, to escalate even more. But, um, you know, I want to just bring that out. But I want to start, you know, uh, with uh, Revelation, uh, the 17th chapter, man. You know, because um, um, this this ties into prophecy, man. You know, and um, I remember, you know, where uh, we used to read uh, um, how the beast is going to hate the whore. And, you know, you know how you just, you know, try to meditate in the spirit and, and you would figure, try to figure how would this come about, you know. And this is one scenario that this will come about because um, really, if you're really had their own mind in their own way, pretty much, you know, they would make some type of deal with, with Russia, man, to be able to supply their people with, with the um, with the energy, man, that they need to keep their, their, their um, country pretty much running. But, you know. Russia's uh, uh, withholding has a, a strong a stranglehold on the whole continent in itself, man. You see, all right. So this is Revelation chapter seventeen, verse one. And there came one of the seven angels, which had seven vials, and talked with me, saying unto me, Come hither, I will show unto thee the judgment of the great whore that sitteth upon many waters. You know, and uh, the waters basically represent, you know, uh, um, the people, man. You know, the masses of the people, pretty much, you know, and, and America is that great whore that sit upon these waters, man. Because why? It's because everybody uh, uh, moves at the tune of the of the U.S., you know, and, uh, you know, we start to see the tide turning to where now, you know, these people, are, these countries are basically posturing and basically looking uh, um, to go their own way and pretty much be self-reliant uh, uh, on, on each other, man, and not rely on this great whore, you know, that made the, uh, the everybody the earth rich pretty much do do their their the abundance of their delicacies man you know this is a a, a, a consumer based economy here in the U.S. and 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 countries have been made rich and even um the the people that dwell within these countries come here to basically make money you know as far as opening up businesses and 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 you know and indulging and and what how the Lord set this place up man. You know, this is that great whore, man, that everybody lies down with and, and commits fornic fornication with, man. You see? But it says, with whom the kings of the earth have committed fornication and the inhabitants of the earth have been made drunk with the wine of a fornication. You know, just, just really I'm, I'm backing it up what the scriptures are speaking about, man. You know, all right. The, the ways of, of, of America, you know, the philosophy that's been going out through the earth. You know, everybody lines themselves up with these pretty much the same philosophies, man. You know, whether it's, it's an agreeance to what 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 it is or basically they will colonize and basically are just going along with the flow. You know, so it goes either way with these people, man. But, you know, in, in Revelation, the 17th chapter, you know, I'm basically trying to hit the points, but I'm pretty much going to jump around a little bit, though, but hit the points that I want to, to make make. All right. But anyway, <clears throat> it says. Um, so he carried him away in the spirit and in the wilderness. And I saw a woman sit upon upon a scarlet colored beast you know and it, you know uh, you're going to um and in the other uh chapters it speaks about um the red the red dragon you know pretty much scarlet is red you know it's pretty much talking about the same thing you know but it says um the scarlet colored beast full of names of blasphemy having seven heads and, and ten horns you know and that's pretty much the whole makeup of the of of, of the, the eu the roman the, the roman empire you know, basically really coming into its uh, fruition of uh, coming in the second leg of Rome. You know, when, when you talk about uh, pretty much the seven heads going into Germany major, Germany mi minor, the Romans, the Greeks, the French, the British, the Spaniards, you know, and there's they all pretty much make up this, the, 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 those seven kingdoms, man. You know, all right. But this is all a, as a whole of, of that Edomite uh, 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 conglomerate uh, 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 EU system, man. The system that's being put in place, man. You know? Okay? And it says, And the woman was arrayed in purple and scarlet color. You know, and that, that purple represents uh, kind of like a, a, a royalty pretty much, man. You know? But it's presented and it's decked with gold and precious stones and pearls, having a golden cup in her hand, full of abominations and filthiness of her fornication. You know? And the Lord had put the golden cup in this, this whore's hand, man. You know, pretty much, man. You know, and really, that's really having the, the rulership over the earth, man. To having it, um, the the abundance, man. That 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 uh, 
the, the decadence, man, of, the, of this place, man, and, and what it what it represents to the world. You know, going back to the heyday of America, man, where people, uh, uh, you know, marveled at this place of, of and people literally thought that this place was uh, 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 paved with gold, man. You know, literally, you see, you know, but, you know, when they got here, you know, it was a different story, though. But but at the end of the day, you know, uh, it was a open road for uh, a so-called immigrant, what you want to call, will come here and really come with nothing and be able to make something out of nothing, man. OK, and they would do much better here in, 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 in the United States than they would, would ever do in their own country. You see, you know, and it was pretty much a, a, a uh, uh, open uh, a road plan, you know, that 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 this 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 whore had laid out, man, to to become uh, rich and really to indulge in, in, in the abominations of this place, man. Take on the philosophies of this place, man. You see. You know, because that's what that golden cup is, is representing uh, uh, within that's within that golden cup is, is the filthiness of a fornication, man. You know, everything, everything goes, man. Do thy wilt. You know, that's basically what, what it is. That's basically the, the, the model of this place, man. You know, and it says, and upon her forehead was a name written, Mystery Babylon, the great, the great, the mother of harlots. The abominations of the earth. And when you want to talk about the abominations of the earth, this place pushes everything under the sun, man. That's an abomination to the scriptures, man. You know? Okay? The mother of harlots, this is that, this is, the Lord set this place up as that, you know, like it's like a pip having uh, their, their, their holes and, 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 and Babylon, is, that's the bottom bitch. Okay? That bottom bitch, man. That's, that's the main one. You know, like I said, you know, the pimp can, can go ahead and, and lose all the other ones, man. But that, that bottom bitch, man, that's his main, that's his main squeeze right there, man. That's his main, that's, that's, that's day one, pretty much, you know? Okay. But that's that, that's that, the mother of all harlots, man. You know, but this is a mystery to most people, man. You see? All right. Because why? It's because why? Because the, the scriptures are, are in allegories, are dark sayings, you know? Okay, sometimes it, go, it jumps forward, it moves back, and, 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 and people, if you ain't in the spirit, you, you, you're not able to, to, to navigate through these scriptures, man. You see? All right? So, so people try to, you know, say that they, you know, they, they figured out what it is, but a lot of, especially these Christians, they don't know what the hell is going on, you know? Okay? But, but the topic is, is, is talking about, you know, uh, the U.S. and how uh, 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 everybody has, has uh, uh, especially... Uh, the people that are that, that that are within that that whole conglomerate of that Edomite um, system, that structure, okay. When you want to talk about uh, the EU and NATO, okay, you know, they, and really all the other nations as well, because they have a stranglehold on all the earth, pretty much through uh, the guise of how they are they are you know the central bank, which is basically has a stranglehold on on all the nations, and pretty much the nations are trying to get out of that. That's that uh, that uh, that IMF, you know, the um, International Monetary Fund, and then the central banks, man. They're trying to get themselves away from that, and they're trying to deal with their own currencies, man, and try to create their own uh, 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 trade alliances, man. You know, and and it's working, you know. And this is furthering the weak in the dollar, man. Okay, and with the sanctions, along with the sanctions, this is what's going to have the EU turn, the beast turn turn on on that great whore, man. You see, you know. But I want to jump around a little bit, though. Um, let's go down to eight. Um, and the beast that thou sowest was and is not and shall ascend out of the bottomless pit and go into perdition. Pretty much going to the destruction mode, man. You know, and that happened uh, pretty much coming out of the bottomless pit. You know, the second leg of, of Rome. OK, the Renaissance, you know, after this, the, the, that, 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 that first Roman Empire was, was shut up pretty much and fell. OK, and, and that's when the Byzantine Empire uh, was uh, uh, came in, you know, and we basically had rulership, man. You know, the, 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 it was in, even though they were going off, you know, as far as what what they are uh, basically the gods that they worshipped. But, you know, that that fulfilled prophecy, man, of how the Lord said that they were going to bring this man down, you know. OK, but now, you know, you're seeing that this 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 uh, uh, beast, OK, that was OK. It says that was when you talk about the, the Roman Empire and is not when they fell. Right. And it says um, and shall ascend out of the bottomless pit and go into perdition, man. And, and really, it goes in, in. It says when you go down here, it says and yet is. So it says 
right? And they shall dwell on the earth and they shall wonder whose names were not written in the book of life from the foundation of the world. And everybody that does not get with this program, man, uh, uh, of this truth, you know, basically you people are, 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 are wondering. You people are, are basically in derision, man, uh, 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 of this beast, man, of this beast system, man. And you're going to go right and in, in cave into it, man. You see? Right? And it says, when they... When they behold the beast that was and is not and yet is, you know, and this man is, is, is basically, you know, uh, his last hurrah, you know, right now. We're in that when that's when that time, man, where he's uh, uh, loosed, you know, for a loose little season, you know, and, and, and deceiving the earth, man, deceiving the whole world. You see, but people are waking up to this guy, man, you know, right. And it says in the beast that was and is not and yet he is the eighth and is of the seven and go off into perdition, you know, and really the, of the seven, you know, when you talk about uh, um, the UK, Britain, you know, um, birth, the US, you know, and US is that eighth, that eighth beast pretty much, you know, because the seven is really talking about the, the kingdoms of, of really the EU, the EU structure, really, you know, but the, um, but through that, okay, the US was birth of that seven, which is the eighth now, you know, okay, and it says, and the ten horns which thou sawest are ten kings which have received no kingdom as yet, but shall receive power as kings one hour with the beast. And these have one mind, and they shall give their power and strength unto the beast. You know, and they all have this one mind of really bringing into bringing rolling out this uh, uh, NWO. You know, and uh, this is that time that they're that they're in now. But now you're starting to see the differences, man. You're starting to see the little cracks in the foundation of what they had, man. But we, we're down to the toes anyway, man. Okay, as, as spoken about in, in, in the um, Book of Daniels, man. You know, and, and really, they're, they're partly weak and partly strong, you know. Because the, the horror is really pulling these other countries along, man. You know, okay. These countries are not, uh, 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 have the strength a, 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 as it is, you know. Uh, a lot of the, a lot of the, the, the military uh, uh, might. Okay, it really comes from the U.S., man. But U.S. gives them gives these um, uh, NATO countries pretty much arms and weapons, and, and that that are pretty much U.S. made. You see, you know. But um, you know, they, then these these countries are, are very formidable, man. Okay, because why? It's because they're not uh, 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 as, as the scriptures talk about, man. Partly weak and partly strong, you know. And and and, and they have weakening. You see the the weakening. Uh, uh, you see the. Uh, uh, the, the weak the weak links okay that, that are within the, the this beast system man you see it man okay right jumping down it says uh in the ten horns which thou sawest upon the beast these shall hate the whore and shall make her desolate and naked and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire and we know that it's gonna come through via uh uh thermal nuclear missiles man okay we can talk we can get into that you know, in, in the 18th chapter, pretty much, man, you know, but the 10 horns, which thou sawest upon the beast, they're going to hate this whore, man. Okay. Why? It's because they're going to blame the, and, and really the common people really blaming the U.S. for this whole thing, man, of uh, the reason why, but you, they really, you're starting to going to see a more of a, uh, 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 a calling out, you know, a coming up against this place, man, because they know that the high energy bills and, and, and businesses that are, that are going to pretty much go under and close down um, are going to be pretty much because of the sanctions that the U.S. is really forcing them to do. It's really forcing them to do it, man. You know, it's really forcing the, the, the new nations to pretty much uh, be in agreement with them and, 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 and sanction Russia, man. You know, which when they know that they need their, their, their resources from them, man. You see? All right. And and really right now this place man this man's a fool man because he's not even giving his own allies any type of uh, uh, alternative man a a a, a solid uh, short you know cheap alternative to basically um um you know keep them you know keep them in, in a in a in a happy state pretty much man or keep them more more aligned of um just keeping them comfortable man you know you see all right so the Lord set this man up man to basically just destroy his own self man. You know, and, and really, like I said, you know, he's basically going to going to have the allies turn against him, man. OK, because why? He's, he's not even taking care of his own. You see. All right. But it says. For for the most high have put their heart, put in their hearts to fulfill his will. And what's his will? 
All right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna get the next precept to get into His will, you know, and to agree and give their kingdom unto the beasts, unto the words of 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 Yahweh Bashim Abishai shall be fulfilled, and the and the woman which thou sawest is a great city, which reigneth over the kings of the earth, man. And we're talking about America, man. You know, all right. That's that that's that harlot, man. That's that harlot that sits on the beast, man. You know, okay. And really, that's that's the one that's just really dragging this place down, man. It's dragging the whole Edomite system down, man. Okay, you know, this man is 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 in in perdition mode, man. You know, he's in perdition mode, man. You know, all right. From there, um, let me jump. I want to grab something and um, let's go to Jeremiah fifty, um, verse nine. Um, and pretty much this is uh um. Uh, Judgment, okay, against Babylon, right, and the Chaldeans, man, all right, spoken of by, by the prophet Jeremiah, all right, but I'm going to jump down to nine, for lo, our race and cause to come up against Babylon, an assembly of great nations from the north country, you know, when you talk about an assembly, you know, you, you, know, you want to have, you want to talk about that, that assembly line, so it's going to be a, a great company of nations, man, okay, to come up against Babylon, man, Babylon the great, you see, all right, and this is what the Lord is doing. The Lord is going to raise these places up, man. Okay? You see? And it says, And they shall set themselves in array against her, and thence shall she be taken. Their arrows shall be as the mighty expert man. None shall return in vain. And, you know, we can get to how, they, how they're going to be in proper order, you know, according to the, in the book of Jewel. You know? All right? And pretty much, hey, the Lord said, man, that, that it's going to get, he's going to set them in array uh, 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 against her, man. Okay, and and we already know that these other countries already have nuclear capability, man. Okay, now when that went out right now, we're talking about all right the other nations now that are gonna come up against this whore, man. Which is which is really their own their own allies, man. Okay, all right, they already have their nuclear capability. All right, let alone when you want to talk about now uh, the likes of of China and, and Iran and uh, India and Pakistan. You know, that pretty much have these capabilities, man. You see? All right. Right. And it says, <clears throat> and Chaldea shall be a spoil and all that spoil her shall be satisfied, saith Yahweh. You know, and, and they're going to be satisfied, man. OK, because they understand that they have the, the, main, the one main common denominator, man. OK, that's in the way that's that that that's that's causing uh, 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 just uh, mayhem on in the earth, man. Okay, through its policies, okay, through its uh, uh, the, uh, democracy, okay, what they want to call, you know, and, 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 and basically, you know, and, and really just, just, just crapping on people, man, you know, for the for lack of better words, man, you know, and it says, right, verse 11, because you were glad, because you rejoiced, O ye destroyers of my heritage, because you were grown fat as the heifer at the grass. And bellow as bulls, you know. This place, man, is, is, is like a a, a a big fat cow, man. You know, living off the land, good, man. This whole country was colonized, man. Okay, this place was paradise when this man set his crusty feet over here, man. You see, and he destroyed the northern kingdom, man. Let alone that the northern kingdom, he also 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 destroyed destroyed uh, the southern kingdom, man. Okay, and and put them in in bondage, man. You see. And this is how this place has um, has became great through free slave labor, man. Okay? Hundreds of years of free slave labor, man. You know? You got people pretty much now here, you know, you know, that are that are sitting on 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 pretty much old money, man. You know? That's something that 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 that, that the Edomite might will not talk about, man. You know? You see? And it says, Um, your mother shall be sore confounded. She that bear you. Shall be ashamed and behold that right hey, hey and we're talking about Britain man okay Britain is gonna be so confounded man and and, and and ashamed man of this place man because why because she gave basically gave you uh, this place came out of of Britain pretty much man you know okay you see and it says behold the hindermost of the nations shall be a, a wilderness and a dry land and a desert man and it's talking about here in, in the Western Hemisphere man. You know, and, and, and Canada, you're not uh, excluded, man, from this judgment, man. You know, 
Canada is not excluded from this judgment, man. You know? Okay, because a lot of these, these countries, man, they, they're all, and they, you know, they all of them are part of that NATO as well, you know? You know, they're not original of the EU, though, but they're part of that NATO, you know? So, uh, you know, judgment is coming here as well, man, you know? Because why? It's because uh, when, you, when you want to get into the history of, of what Canada has done, uh, okay, to the, to the tribe of Gad, you know, it's a horrific uh, uh, and, and, and extensive uh, uh, history, okay, that, that can't be hid, man, okay? They got to pay for that, man. You know, and it says, because of the wrath of, of Yahweh Bashem I was shy, it shall not be inhabited, but it shall be wholly desolate. Everyone that goeth by Babylon shall be astonished and hiss at her plagues, man. You know, and, 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 and we had uh, uh, different prophets that spoke about this, man. Okay, you see, yeah, you know, we can go into uh, uh, Isaiah, you know, pretty much Ezekiel, and, like, all of the prophets spoke about this place, man. Joel, you see. Okay, and hey, there's a great judgment that's coming, man. And we're, we're starting to see now through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Shema Shai how that scenario can be played out, man. And it's going to be played out by uh, having causing a, a economic downturn in Europe and, and really causing the people to, to uh, 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 really uh, see things for what it is, man. You know, okay, and really America is not even, has always been despised at the end of the day, man. You know, we you know you, you go to Europe, man. You, you, you got to watch, man, of, of letting them know that you're an, you're an American, man. You know, OK, the common people, man, do not really, really care for American people, man. You know, you see. <laughs> but it says um, that 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 uh, everyone that goes by Babylon should be astonished and hiss at her plagues, man. Going into our, our, our Revelation 18 chapter, man. You see, put yourselves in array against Babylon. This is 14. Put yourselves in array against Babylon round about. All ye that bend the bow, shoot at her. Spare no arrows, for she has sinned against Yahweh. You know? And, and, and who in all these countries basically bend the bow. Okay? Including uh, uh, Babylon's allies, man. Okay? Which you want to talk about the European Union. Okay? They all bend the bow. Okay? And, and we're speaking also about uh, uh, when you want to talk about uh, uh, Russia, you know the countries from the, uh, the the ones from the North Country, man. Okay, that are gonna come up against this place, man. Okay, but it says, shout against her round about. She have given her hand. Her foundations are falling. Her walls are thrown down. Okay, what what the Lord say, man? Ye shall build, but I will throw down, man. You know. Okay, talk about Edom, man. Right, and it says. For it is the vengeance of Yahweh. Take vengeance upon her as she have done do unto her. You know? So how this place has has, has an extensive history that is not hid and well documented of uh, rape, robbery, murder, okay? And, 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 and destruction, okay? It says here, take vengeance upon her as she had done do unto her. You see? Okay? And uh, uh, um, it's going to be a, a, a terrible day, man. It's going to be a terrible day, okay, for, for this place, man. Okay, because why? It's because the sins have reached up to up, up to the heavens, man. And, 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 and for that, and at a point in time, okay, it's going to rain upon these people, man, while they're eating, man. Okay, speaking about the ones that, that, are, that are pretty much, uh, um, you know, uh, the puppet masters, pretty much, if you want to say. Okay, you know, but when, but when the real puppet master comes, okay. You know, and, and, and you, you're, you're going to be found out that you're just a man. You see? All right. But, uh, hey, man, you know, the, you know, we're starting to see, you know, how the scenarios pretty much are going to play out, you know. Um, and it's pretty much um, uh, uh, other articles that I want to bring out, you know, you know, on the subject matter, pretty much, you know. But, um, you know, I didn't want to make it too, too long, you know, and, um, you know, and I want to just, you know, tie it in and just be edifying, you know, for the for the for the uh, for the video. But um, there's other articles pretty much in, uh, uh, you know, that go into this, man. And, and, and you know, you got another one is with the CEO of a country in Europe that's pretty much uh, singing, um, you know, how how they're going to have uh, uh, pretty much problems, man, economically, man. You see? All right. And again, man, it's going to be a cold winter, man. It's going to be a cold winter because now, you know, 
now they they doing it right in time for now the seasons are gonna gonna change, and and winter is about to hit Europe very soon, man. Okay, so now you know now that summer's gonna be over with, now you're gonna really see um, this energy crisis really take full effect, man. It's gonna really affect the people now once the weather starts to change, man. Okay, you see. So they already are. Um, Russia is pretty much already ahead of, of, of the season, man, and they're already shutting it down. You know. So hey, you know, uh, and, and 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 I don't. We don't see, you know, pretty much um, the U.S. pretty much overturning the sanctions, man. It's highly unlikely, man. You know, they're they're doing the Lord's will, man. Okay, and the, his will has to be carried out, and, and he has to make some people mad. You know, okay, he has to make some people mad. Okay, you have to have some people come up against this place, man. Okay, you see, you know, a uh, uh, foolish uh, uh, decision making, man. Okay, you know, the Lord, you know, this Lord said that this man is uh, the children of fools, uh, children of base men, you know. All right, and this man is is, is in perdition mode, man. And you know, he, he, you know, you leave him, you leave him to himself. He's gonna bring himself to his own ruin, man. But yet, and still, he wants to uh, point out a boogeyman, you know. But anyway, you know, with that, you know, um, I hope this lesson was edifying. Uh, call hello, Yahweh, Bashim Abushai, Bashim Rakakwadash, Shalom.